my name is Maddie okay. Allen, and I'm the advocacy manager at the Center for Public Justice. Um, in the last year, one of my favorite projects I got to work on was the Juvenile Justice Convening, which gathered many different lead church leaders, people of faith, and faith-based organizations to talk about the solutions you know was, uh, moving forward to reform the juvenile yeah, was, justice system in the United States. I am looking forward to working on the Our Families Valued Projects, um, specifically hosting tech studies with leaders in the field. Hello, my name is Oliver Mee. I'm the Operations Manager at the Center for Public Justice. The project that I most recently, the big project most recently worked on was helping transition us from our uh, old donor database system to our new donor database system. And I'm looking forward to continuing our operational efficiencies here at the office. Hi, I'm Stephanie Summers, and I'm the CEO of the Center for Public Justice. This past year, I've been really excited about bringing a whole bunch of new members onto our team. So we've been able to communicate and grow uh, and share our impact with more people, and that continues to expand the mission. I'm looking forward to uh, finishing our strategic plan. We've been working with a great strategic planning team, and I'm looking forward to bringing that to completion this summer and being able to share a bunch of new work as we go into the fall. My name is Ella Alvarado. I'm the Communications Associate at CPJ, and a project that I enjoyed working on last year was highlighting our 2022 fall interns. And a project that I'm looking forward to is highlighting our Hatfield Prize recipients. Hello. My name is Mario Alfaro, uh, the director uh, for Equipment Ministries Fellowship uh, based in Texas uh, for the Center for Public Justice. So this is our launching uh, program for Equipment Ministries Fellowship. So we were able to um, launch the program. So we did all the seven sessions. So we were thrilled about that. Right now I'm excited about uh, the pastors that I'm working with to be able to take uh, those sessions that they learn and implement them in their projects. Hi, my name is Sophia Timina. I'm a research fellow here at CPJ. Um, I've been enjoying researching faith-based child care and I'm looking forward to further digging into it this year. Hello, my name is Alyssa Leston and I'm the development associate here at the Center for Public Justice. One of my favorite parts of my job and something that I'm so grateful to be a part of is getting to interview donors and supporters of CPJ. I love getting to hear their testimonies and it's such a joy to hear how CPJ has made an impact in their lives and how it's making an impact on the world. Greeting Earthlings. I'm Stanley Carlson Teese. I direct the Institutional Religious Freedom Alliance at the Center for Public Justice. Um, this last year, one thing I worked on was the Respect for Marriage Act, which protects gay marriages in federal law, but also organizations and people who believe in traditional marriage. That was a really important advance, and I was glad to work with allies on that. Uh, for this new year, one thing I'm working on is uh, a, a paper documenting how the faith-based initiative has developed over time, and to bring back to the foreground of public knowledge and government respect the role of faith-based organizations and what they do in our society. Hi, my name is Emily Framke and I'm the program director for Shared Justice. And a project that I have worked on in the past year was pulling together different panels for the Jubilee Conference that we go to every year. We, we meet with Christian college students and they learn about honoring God and government and how they can advocate for their neighbors through public policy. So that's one thing we've been working on and one thing I'm really excited about in the upcoming year is celebrating our Civitas Fellows. They've just completed a four month long leadership development program for Christian congressional staff and we'll be celebrating our first cohort this summer. Hi, my name is Deborah Hede. I'm the Director of Communications at CPJ. A project that I really enjoyed working on was um, creating our new website or helping with the development of our new website. And I'm excited to get a TikTok account for CPJ this year. I'm Dawn Brotherton, Director of Development at the Center for Public Justice. That means that I get to interact with our donors and let people know all the great things that we do here. Um, last year, I was able to uh, work on the annual report, tell people stories about um, what happens with our interns and on Capitol Hill and in our office, interacting with lots of different um, government officials and 
people who run faith-based organizations. Um, I'm really happy to begin work on our new endowment campaign. We have a $500,000 matching gift that's going to be used to build a million dollar endowment, so that's super exciting and I'm looking forward to letting people know how to give to that in the next year. Hi, I'm Rachel Anderson. I'm a fellow at the Center for Public Justice and founder of CPJ's Families Valued Project. The Families Valued team is excited to do, continue to do its work this year um, advocating for policies that, su that support family life, like paid family leave and maternal health care. We gather every quarter for a community call and we invite you to join us by signing up at the CPJ website for the Families Valued newsletter. My name is Madeline Panel. I'm the Shared Justice Fellow. I have really enjoyed working on the 2022 Hatfield Prize Reports. I'm super excited to be working on the Civitas program.